Step one, wake up early, gon' rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, think grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please stand and join me for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. And now join me for the Tiger Pledge. Today, I will try my best, imagine my possibilities, and give respect. I will be eager to learn, realize my worth, and smile every day. Our guidelines for success go like this. Focus, focus on the positive. Intent, practice positive intent. Safety, keep it safe. Helpfulness, be helpful to others. Encouragement, you can do it. Respect, show respect to others and myself. And now for a moment of silence. to sing the school family song you are my family my school family i feel happy when you are here i hope you know friends how much i love you we're a part of keep you near on espanol familia somos Now it's time to wish well. So look around your classroom and see who in your school family's not here today. Let's put them in our hearts and let's wish them well. We wish you well. We wish you well. All through the day today, we wish you well. Deseamos lo mejor. Deseamos lo mejor. Todo el día de hoy, deseamos lo mejor. And then send out all your love and well wishes. Trick or Treat at Fisher, Candy Collection, October 1 until October 26. It is time to start collecting candy for our Trick or Treat drive through event at Fisher Elementary. Families send candy daily to be collected during the month of October for us to have enough candy to give away during the evening of Trick or Treat drive through on Thursday, October 27. We make this a friendly competition by offering the classroom that brings the most candy to win popcorn and a movie during the month of December.
Living life every day, late at night, not okay. All I want and I pray, all I need are some better days. The Pasadena Food Drive has started. We will be collecting canned goods this week until November 1st. The food collected is distributed each year to Pasadena's local food banks, shelters, and pantries. We will be helping those in our community. Your classroom is invited to join in this food drive as an act of kindness and generosity. Giving to others instills a sense of purpose in our students, and their small gift can make a difference in someone else's life. You can record your classroom's canned goods and food items each day. Then, send the food collected to one of the two large boxes that are at the front school entrance. Follow the QR code on the box or use the link to the Google Form emailed to you to log your cans daily, weekly, or as needed. The classroom that logs the most canned goods and food items will receive an ice cream party, your picture taken to place on the school website, and recognized on the morning announcements. This week is Worldwide Character Counts Week. On Monday, respect is the character trait of the day. Respect means to treat others with respect and follow the golden rule. The golden rule is do unto others as you would have them do to you. So in other words, if you want someone to treat you right and nicely with respect, then you treat others nicely, kindly, and with respect. Be tolerant and accepting of differences. Not all of us are alike. We're raised by different families, and each family is a different culture. And then there are different cultures in our own community. Make sure you don't judge others and you accept them for who they are. Use good manners and not bad language. When we go into the cafeteria, we have our good manners posted the way we're supposed to act when we're in the cafeteria. Well, there's other times that we're we use good manners too, like saying hello, saying goodbye, saying thank you, please. And we'll talk about that a little bit more in a minute. Be considerate of the feelings of others. That means use your empathy. And empathy is putting ourselves in other people's shoes. Don't threaten, hit, or hurt anyone. Deal peacefully with anger, insults, and disagreements. Now that you know a few things about respect, let's think about what it looks like and what it sounds like. What does respect look like? That you look into somebody's eyes when they're speaking. That you wait your turn. That you share with others. That you're helpful with others. And I know a lot of you are being helpful right now because that's one thing we've been working on all month long. And many of you have walked up and told me, how you've been helpful in your home and school. Carefully listen. We listen to others and really carefully listen. A lot of times it will keep misunderstandings from happening. And be kind. Now, what does respect sound like? Respect sounds like this. Excuse me. Please. Thank you. No, thank you. Speaking clearly using a kind and cheerful voice. So you can see right there where manners comes in to being respectful. Okay, my friends, you know what to do. Clap your hands, stomp your feet. It's time to say goodbye to all my friends. Goodbye. It's time to say goodbye to all my friends. Goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Give a wave and wink your eye. It's time to say goodbye to Applaudy. He's a gonna be it. I gotta see adios, some, some. 